Let's look at that 1986 article by Edward Berkowitz on history, public policy and reality. In that article, Edward Berkowitz makes some claims. He says that historians have something to teach public policy makers and public policy analysts. Or rather, he says that public policy analysts have something to learn from historians, because the task of the historian is to explain the present in terms of the past. How did we get here? How did the past contribute to where we are today? And he gives a couple of policy examples where he says public policy makers can learn something from historians. He refers to minimum wage laws and the original purpose of AFDC. You'll see that when it comes to minimum wage laws, he claims that economists back in 86 were pretty much all agreed about who it is that minimum wage laws hurt. And when it comes to AFDC, he said that uh, the original purpose of AFDC was, well, I want you to tell me what it is, fill in the blank, and then write a list of questions that you would need to ask and answer in order to determine whether he's correct. So let me put this another way, I hope simply. I want you to tell me what questions you would need to ask in order to determine whether Berkowitz is correct in his claim about the original purpose of the AFDC program. Okay, I want your questions. I don't necessarily want you to tell me whether he's correct. If you happen to find out, great. But what I really want to know is how you would go about finding out whether his claim regarding the original purpose of AFDC is correct, okay?